Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K screen paint using ambient light rejection technology gain times seven and eight. Now, today we're going to do a very interesting demonstration. I'm going to be showing the screen paint form of the Supreme 8. We got a demonstration set up outside with a screen, one half painted with the Supreme 8, the other half is painted with a bare silver screen kind of gray mixture. Now, to make this mixture, I use a little bare silver screen, I use some Metallica silver, and a little black, a little crystal into it, that uh, Christmas, I call Christmas glitter, to show you that even if you use a light gray screen, no matter how you mix it, how you make it, it's still gonna fail. You're not gonna be to get that 20,000 to one, or that 12,000 to one, or 10,000 to one, when it comes to your screen, you're not gonna be able to achieve it. Now over here, I'm using my Ultra Short Though Projector. This is my Optima GT5500, just to show you that the Supreme 8 is fully compatible with Ultra Short Though Projectors. Not only that, the fact that it can be used in ambient light environments, and that's why majority of these demonstrations we will be doing on the Supreme 8 will be outdoors. Now, I've had a few people asking me if I've set up a screen under an awning, or under a deck or under on their porch how would the screen react that's why we're doing these demonstrations right now and as i said before i know as i said i said before a lot i said a lot but as i said before did it again sorry about that that um when you're using a supreme ace outside it has a certain requirement you have to use it with a projector of 3500 lumens and up or inside you can use it with a projector as low as 1100 lumens so keep in mind some of these screens on the market would cost you four and five thousand dollars when our technology can be used for indoor and outdoor and it's ultra short though compatible so look at this fully lit environment ultra short though projector i'm using my um my uh, Optima GT 5500. So we're gonna pop outside real quick where I have a demonstration set up. And this is just to show you that no matter how you mix the paint, I don't care if it's gray or if it's white or silver, it is going to fail you. So this is where it was coated right here. And then over here, there's the projector right there, set up with the sound bar. I'm gonna go out there and take a look. right there, there's the screen paint right here. We are at time, we're at around 8.44. I said one of the hardest demonstrations to pull off outside is and star is the um what do you call it the star field demonstration because this will show whether or not if your paint can pull up or a screen can pull up full contrast and as you can see our black screens pull up contrast where the bare silver screen mixture does not Now the reason why we're doing these demonstrations outside is just to show you exactly how powerful the technology is compared to most people are going to be doing demonstrations inside the house and a dim environment where we can do this outside at around 8.44 in the morning. And before anybody says, well hey, you're using a 4300 lumen projector, keep in mind the bare silver screen paint mixture is also included. It's being used with 4,300 lumens. Let me show you how far my projector sits back. So we're probably about a good 9 to 10 feet back from the screen. Like I said, one of the hardest demonstrations to pull off is the star field. You're not going to see too many people trying to do this one. All right, so let's do some outer space. We'll do a floating meteor storm or meteor shower. Now, 
Now, as I said before, any screen paint that can produce an image outside, inside, is a cakewalk. So while you're sitting there watching these demonstrations in these dim, poorly lit environments, we're doing demonstrations outside. Doesn't make a difference, it's a projector's 4300 lumens, it's right next to a gray screen. They're both taking on the same amount of, of lumens, and they're both taking on the same amount of light. The only difference is you can see our technology where this one is completely gone. Let's put in a burning fire. Now I guarantee you that no screen, like I said, no light screen or white screen is ever going to be able to do this or be able to perform the same demonstration that we're doing right now due to the fact that that screen will wash out on any caliber projector you're using. Keep in mind, this is a powerhouse projector. This is a 4300 lumen projector, 1920 by 1200 WXGA projector. Very high powered. And our screen can easily pull up outside on dark contrast 